Hi guys, my name is Hajatin Ansari and you're watching the third tutorial on C programming and today I will be talking about the rules used for naming variables and I'm also going to be talking about constants. So first let me define my integer variable num and I'm going to initialize it to the integer value 8. So what I'm going to do is that I'm simply going to print the value of my variable num. So this is very simple, when I run the program, I should be getting the value 8 in the output screen. So this right here, num, this is the name of my variable. So the first rule is that the name can have capital letters, it can have digits and it can have the spatial character underscore. So for example, let me write capital N and let me write an underscore and let me write a digit for example 6. And let me change this right here as well. So this is a valid name. So when I try to run the program, it will display the value of the variable a capital N U M underscore six in the output screen. So the second rule is that you cannot add digits as the first character of your variable name. For example, if I add a six right here and I add a six right here. So when I try to run the program, the compiler will give me an error because I'm using the digit 6, I'm using an integer as my first character which is not allowed. The third rule is that you cannot use any other special character besides the underscore character. So for example if I add a left parenthesis right here and if I add a left parenthesis right here as well, so when I try to run the program again the compiler will give me an error. So the name of the variable can only have the underscore as the special character inside it. It cannot have any other special character inside the name. So and the fourth rule is that you cannot make keywords as names of variables. Okay, um, yeah. So if I add, for example, I make the name of my variable printf and I try to print the value of the variable printf. Again, this will give me an error because printf is a reserved keyword for the C language. It is the name of a function which is built in the C language. So I cannot use it as the name of my variable. So now when I run the program, again, it will give me an error. So this is all it, these are all the rules for naming variables. And now let's talk about constants. So a constant is used to make the value of the variable fixed. So once you've made it fixed, you cannot change it later on in your program. So in order to do that, just write the correct name of your variable and write const. Either you can write it before the data type or after the data type. So let me just first print again, print the value of the constant variable num. So now when I run the program, it will display the value 8 of the constant variable in my output screen. But if I try to change the value of the variable num, so suppose I try to change it to 9 for example, so this is not allowed because I've made my variable num constant, I've made it fixed. So when I try to run the program, it's going to give me an error. So it is illegal for me to change the value of a constant variable. So this is all it about constants and um, naming variables and just to show you that I'm going to write my data type first and I'm going to write const afterward and it means the same thing. So you can switch it if you want. So this is all it about um, uh, naming variables and constants. If you have any questions, please ask them in the comment section and thanks for watching this video.